Hey guys, Landon is back with another video. So today, we're gonna talk about the TR1 tire upgrade for the S18. Is this tire any good, and is it right for you? Stick around to find out. So if you want to get your hands on one of these bad boys, I think they're from Japan. Um, it can be difficult to get them, I heard. If you stick around till the end of the video, I'll tell you where I got mine from and where you could probably get yours from as well. So if you don't already know, these come with an on-road tire from the factory and they look something like this. So yeah, I don't know why King Song chose to do that from the factory, seeing as this is probably more of an off-road machine but they did. So if you do a lot of off-roading, you're probably gonna wanna upgrade the tire. This has a lot more road noise than the stock one. I actually kinda like that. Um, makes you a little more present, I guess, on the road. Um, this is what it sounds like. So if you're trying to be super stealth on your S18, this probably isn't the tire for you on road. And if you plan on putting this tire on yourself, uh, and you haven't done a tire change before, just note that on the S18, there are shims on the axles, and every S18, I believe, has a different shim configuration depending just on the tolerances from the factory. So you gotta make note when you take the tire off how many shims are on each side, and you gotta copy that when you put the tire back on. Otherwise, your tire's not gonna fit right in the fender well, and you're gonna have rubbing issues, and it's not gonna be a happy time for you. So comparing this tire with the old one, you're gonna see that it sits a lot closer to the fender. It's just, there's more tread. So it's, uh, it fits very well, but it is tight. And some trade-offs for that is, sometimes you get rocks in here, it makes a terrible sound. I haven't had any issues yet from it, but that's the thing that could happen. Um, it definitely just fits a lot tighter in here, but I think it's okay. On-road performance with this tire is actually quite good. Once you get over that initial weirdness, you can carve with this tire very easily. Uh, it feels like you have just as much traction on the dry pavement, if not a little bit more than the original tire. Cornering traction on this on-road feels great. If you hit a little bit of gravel on-road with this, it doesn't feel as sketchy like with the original tire. So I would say this is still an upgrade for on-road if you're cool with the way it feels. Now let's talk about off-road performance. Off-road performance on this tire is amazing. So if you bought an S18 and you're doing any amount of off-road, you should probably buy this tire because it is going to enhance your off-road performance a lot. Not only do I feel like I have more control when I'm off-road, I have more confidence, but I can also go faster I can go faster around corners. I can go faster on loose stuff. It's totally transformed this wheel when it comes to off-road. Just another note, this tire has one, two, three, four, five little individual channels, and they're each on their own angle. Now, why does that matter? You can actually feel it when you're leaning. So this isn't like a, a purely linear lean, I guess. With the regular tire, it was round, so you can lean as much as you want, and there's no sort of hesitation on the amount of leaning you have. This one, you really can feel those individual tracks. So I've gotten myself into situations when I wasn't used to riding it, that you kind of get on the first track, and you almost get stuck, and you have to actually really consciously put effort in to get onto this track or back on the center. Once you get used to it, it's fine. It's just you have to put a lot more effort in to initiate those leans. Now I said I'd tell you where I bought this tire from. I bought this tire from EVs in Vancouver, BC. They're a great store. I don't know how many they keep on stock all the time, but I know he usually has some. So reach out to them. Use my coupon code LANDOCYCLE to get yourself a discount. And uh, they can also install the tire for you if you're local. So I think that concludes this video. To sum it up, I really like this tire a lot. Uh, it took some getting used to, but I think it's pretty rewarding because it, it just turns this thing into a beast. It feels way more capable with this tire on, so you should get one. 
So thank you all so much to all who have subscribed already. Can't believe I already have 200. Um, thank you for everyone that's commented, liked. It's, uh, it really helps me to keep making these. These are a lot of work to make. I don't get paid for them. Uh, if you want to help me at all, you could use the coupon code because every time somebody buys with that coupon code, I get a little bit of money to spend at Evie's and uh, that just helps me. So on that note, thanks for watching and I'll catch you on the next one.